this beautiful 1961 Mercedes-Benz 300 SL Roadster is about to go across the auction block at no reserve. That's right, it'll be sold today. So stay tuned and see what happens when a $1.5 million car goes across the auction block here in Scottsdale, Arizona at the Worldwide Auction. This Mercedes-Benz 300 SL is the younger brother to the world famous 300 SL Gullwing that was in production from 1954 to 1957. Then in 1957, production on the SL Roadster began. The SL Roadster ran from 1957 to 1963, this being in 1961, one of the later production vehicles. It is only one of 250 that were produced in 1961 with the very sought after black exterior paint with red interior. The SL stood for super light and this car was. It was mostly a tube chassis with an inline six cylinder engine with mechanical fuel injection that was laid down at a 45 degree angle in order to get that low hood line. Truly a remarkable car. Let's go inside and see how it does on the auction block. All today to the highest bidder. 1 million, 100 I bid, 1 million, 150 I'll give. But you have to be quick. 1 million, 150. 1 million, 150,000. 1 million, 150,000. 1 million I am bid. 1.1 1 .1 I am bid. 1 million, 150. 1 million, 150,000. Are you all done? We sell the car today. Make no mistake. 1 million, 1 is bid. 1 million, 125 if you like it. 1 million, 125,000. I sell the car today. I thought it would bring a million five or six guys, honestly. One million one, one phenomenal car, factory black, big brake roadster. Absolutely no mistake can be made if you purchase this, guys. One million one is bid, one million 125. I sell it if you're done. Are there any further bids? At one million 125,000. At one million 125 for the first time. 1,125,000, ladies and gentlemen, for the second time. At 1,125,000, I sell the car. Are y'all done? Third and final time, I have sold 1.1 million. 1.1 million is the winner. Bitter 5.5, five. bitter 5.5 five five at 1.1 million. Wow. That surely was not what the seller was expecting. As you heard from the auctioneer, he said they were expecting 1.5 to 1.6 million for the car. That's what happens when you sell a car without reserve. The seller's hoping that without reserve will cause some fury around the car and you'll get a couple of bidders uh, bidding the price up, but did not have the right bidders with this auction. The good news is somebody got a really good deal on a beautiful 300 SL. Well, I hope you liked the short video. If you did, please subscribe to my channel and I will see you on the next one. Thank you.